Thank you for joining us today on Coffee With. My guest today is Jennifer McGuffey Walker. And Jennifer, you're a loan originator with NOLA Lending LLC, mm -hmm. um, who is actually a mortgage lender. And I know that NOLA has some other offices besides the one just mm -hmm. here in Vicksburg. Mm -hmm. Tell us a little, let's start talking about NOLA, NOLA. Lending, and then okay. let's get into the interesting stuff, which is your life. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> sounds good. Um, NOLA Lending Group um, LLC is out of, based out of Mandeville, Louisiana. Um, we have several offices all over the state of Louisiana, and we're just now kind of getting into Minis uh, Mississippi. Um, so Vicksburg was the first office in Mississippi, um, and we now have recently, in the past few weeks, opened offices in Madison, Oxford, South Haven, and soon to be Flowood. Well, you know what excites um, so. me about that is that, to me, it means that the economy is picking up mm -hmm. if we got mm -hmm. lenders out there that are starting to open offices around the state. And um, that makes me really excited. Me too, so. me too. So we're we're doing great. I mean, we've been um, here, I guess, since December, December 1st. So, um, you know, going on five months and, and, and doing great. Well, and you are my next door, you're my next door business neighbor. Mm -hmm. You and Harley Caldwell and I all have our little one-stop mm -hmm. shopping mm -hmm. right there on the frontage yes. road. We invite yes. people to come out, of yes. course. <laughs> um, but you're new to the business area. Mm -hmm. um, now, what were you doing before you opened the NOLA Lending Office here in Vicksburg? Before, I actually, I graduated from the University of Southern Miss in um, Southern Mississippi in 2004. Um, and after that, I actually started working for a large, very well-known financial company. Um, and I was with them for a little over six years. Um, and left them, I guess, it's been last July, last Ju July or so, and um, to pursue, you know, NOLA Lending. So. Okay. Um, and in between there, bought a house and got married and all well, that. Well, congratulations. Kind of <laughs> Thank you. So Thank the you. loan um, origination so. role isn't anything oh. new. No. I mean, actually, the folks that you're working with, NOLA Lending, mm -hmm. were some of the same people you were working with at the other company. Exactly. Correct. And they just exactly. kind of went out yes, on their own. Yes, exactly. And they kind of recruited me. I'm so glad you're there. <laughs> it's nice to have you as a next-door neighbor. Yes. I'm, and I'm glad to be there next to you and Harley. You've been wonderful these past few months and I definitely appreciate that. Okay, so you've become involved with the Chamber. I have. So tell me what you've done so far with the Chamber. So Because you're one of our newest members. Yes. We're very glad to have because yes. you're kind of that younger age group. I am. I am. Um, and I am a new member of the Chamber. Um, actually, my first big event was the Business After Hours NOLA was a part of um, and that was this just a few weeks ago. Yes. So that was very successful. Um, we had a big, you know, turnout come out for the community. Um, so definitely appreciate that. Um, also, I'm getting involved in ties um, as well. So that's for you know the young professionals, anybody under under 40. So um, and there's events going on all the time. You know, with new businesses opening and. Um, lots of get togethers and getting to meet a lot of good people around town. So I'm it's a great way to really network in this community it. as yes. a new business owner. I, yes, I'm very, I'm we have a very, very active chamber, and yes. it's uh, it makes a big difference when you own a business and are trying to do business in a town this size. Huge difference, I, and I never realized until because I was here a few months before I joined. Yeah, um, just trying to get everything together, and you know I'm getting the emails every few days, you know, with events that are going on and. Um, grand openings and business after hours and it's just it's really exciting and then so. I was bugging you going did you do your application yet yeah. hey Jennifer have you done your application hey Jennifer I know it's like sitting on my like, desk here she comes again no it was sitting on my desk the entire time and I'm right. like okay I need to go turn this in like you know when you but you know how it is starting you got a lot going on starting up on your own right. and it, it's a lot going on it's a lot so going on. but I'm enjoying it I'm just you know going right through the you know steps so excellent well like I said we're so delighted to have you there and um, nice to have a good neighbor right next door to us so. um, okay so you just got married within yes. the last year mm -hmm. when did y'all get married we got married October 16th did you get married here I did got married here at the First Presbyterian Church mm -hmm. um, and we had our reception at the BB Club mm -hmm. so here in Vicksburg so it was it was great um, loving it. We're just, we both, he just started uh, a new job right before we got married. And then I started uh, NOLA Lending right after we got back from the home. I, I actually was testing and everything when we got back um, after the honeymoon. Yeah. So it's kind of been nonstop since the wedding. But and then you bought a house. And then we bought a house. And, and you've been redoing some of the things. Remodeling yeah. the house, yes. yes. In fact, so. you were doing some remodeling just so you could move into the house. Exactly. I know yes. at one point. We totally 
gutted it. It was a house, a house built out in Oak Park in, um, in the 70s. So uh, we took down walls and had new floors, new countertops, and all kinds of stuff. Are you so, done, or is it an I'm, ongoing process? Well, I mean, it's, it's livable, but, you know, of course, I, there's still a ton of stuff I want to do. Always stuff to do. Yeah, always stuff to do. So. I bought a remodeled house, and mm -hmm. there's always stuff to do. And I love that, though. Yeah. So, And I, I don't plan on going anywhere for a long time, so yeah. I'm excited You're going to be that. my neighbor a long time. Yes, I hope so. Carly keeps telling me I need to buy a building, and I'm like, uh -huh. Okay, hmm, I'm gonna take Jennifer with me. I don't know what Harley's gonna think about that. I know. I, know. I think I I love where where I'm at. It's a and great it's location. Perfect. It is, you've been great hospitality and and Harley as well. And I, I just couldn't ask for more. Yeah. You know, getting started on it. Three so. strong businesswomen. I know. It's I know. fun. I was thinking it? about that the other day. I said, hmm, three women right here. I mean, I this is you know great. I know. So I know, and it's you know, I was at a, a meeting the other day and looking around the room at other insurance agents and realizing how many, you know, kind of in a male dominated profession, mm -hmm. how oh, many yeah. female insurance agents oh, yeah. there are in town. And then I saw that um, Nan Stewart took mm -hmm. over Robbie Pennock's insurance agency. So we now we have another one and right. there's um, Susan Johnston and there's Stacia. And I mean, there are a lot of yeah. female insurance agents and there also are I think most of the loan originators are predominantly in, in female. In Vicksburg, they yeah. are predominantly female, yes. Right. Um, which is, is also different in the finance industry. Um, you know, men, you know, there's a lot of right. men in upper management, and so it's very encouraging. Um, I think, Girl power, you know, I, I love know, it. I know, I know. So um, it, I, I think it's just wonderful, yeah. you know, for, for Vicksburg and, and for, for business. So. So what do you do for fun? Because I know you don't originate loans 24 hours a day. You probably would, but uh -huh. Clint might not let you do uh -huh, that. Yeah. And you've got to have a little fun. Uh -huh. What do y'all, what, what kind of hobbies do y'all have? Well, we have two Labrador Retrievers. Um, and so children. we love, yes, our children. We don't have any, you know, children yet. So we've been together, um, we've only been married, you know, what, six, what is it, six months now? Like but that. been together, it'll be 11 years this year. So, oh my goodness. yeah, long time. Um, so no, our labs are our, our babies, uh -huh. um, and so we enjoy playing with them and you know taking them on walks, taking them to the lake, things like that. Um, we love going to New Orleans. In fact, we're going tomorrow. Um, I actually lived in New Orleans right after college mm -hmm. until you know Hurricane Katrina, um, and still have a lot of friends that live there. And we're we're going tomorrow for the the Hornets Lakers game, and then we're going to the Zurich Classic, the the PGA tournament. So um, we go down there just for for fun, uh, a lot actually. You're um, always going somewhere. I know. Because you're always like, hey, I want, I'll be gone. I'm going to. Atlanta. I know. Hey, I have a girlfriend that's getting married. I'm going here. And well, <laughs> hey, my girl. And I have a girlfriend getting married Saturday. I know. It seems like um, we're at that age when you're y'all are kind of all starting to settle down. Getting a little bit. married, getting mm -hmm. settled down. Yes. Mm -hmm. And so it's a lot of fun. But we love going to New Orleans. Clint loves to fish. He likes just getting away from everything and just fishing and just being out there. I, I get bored. I'm just like, okay, you know, I got to do, you know, this, you know, they're not biting. I mean, I, I got to go find something to do, you know. Um, and I love shopping. So, you know, he can go fish and I can shop. Do you like shoes? Love shoes. Okay. Love shoes. Cindy Miller. Do you know Cindy? She, you know Cindy. Yes. You just don't, she works over at the um, chamber office. Yes, 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 they yes, just yes, moved yes, here yes. From yes. Illinois, Chicago, mm -hmm. I think. Yes, I did. Um, she yes. is a shoe freak like I am. Uh -huh. So I interviewed her and uh -huh. we decided our next outing. She's never been to Anchuca for lunch. Oh. So I made her promise not to go until mm -hmm. she and I are going to go. Together. And then we're going to go do oh, the shoe yeah. thing. So you can come and do the shoe thing. Oh, so you don't have to go to Atlanta, New Orleans. Yeah, I know. I know. Have girlfriends right I here. know. And I do, I do love to, to shop local when, you know, when I'm home. And the weekends, and I'm decorating my house. I come downtown. We have the cutest shops down here, so I love to. It's to, a great place. To definitely. Is there anything I didn't ask you that you want to talk about? Um, I I can't think of anything <laughs> right off the top of my head. Well, we're delighted to have another female business owner here. Just a business owner in general, mm -hmm. but um, a female business owner and. Um, you. Thank you. We hope that people come and do the one-stop shopping. Yes. And after exactly. we had the business after hours, mm -hmm. um, you and Harley and I got together and decided that instead of doing it every three or four years, we're going to make it an annual event. Annual. And yes. It's going to. Yes. Everybody will know 
the first Thursday of April or whenever mm -hmm. we decide to have it, that that's going to be the business after hours over at our little business complex yes. and put it on their calendar because we had a lot of fun and we had a lot of yes. people. It was, and we it had was fabulous perfect. fabulous store products. Yes, we did. It was perfect. I can't, I mean, I know y'all have been there for, you've been there, what, four years? Four, five, yeah. Four, yeah, mm -hmm. Lord, and only at that time, I think four or five months, and um, it was, it was huge. I know we, you know, definitely with y'all's success, you know, brought in the businesses and and it was a great it was way for me to meet a lot of people. people. I know, I know. It was I know. a lot of people. I know, so. It really was. So. It was great. It was perfect opportunity for me to meet people. So I definitely appreciated that. Well, thank you for coming yes. and having coffee with me today. I get to see you every day, but yes. not everybody else yes. does. And yes. even though they may know you, they may not know you're in the lending business now. Um, so basically, if you have somebody, there's somebody that's looking to purchase a house, they need a mortgage, yes. they need to come see you. Yes. Do you yes, want to give some information about where you're located, the address, the phone number, the um, website? Yes, I'm actually, um, well, I'm on the Frontage Road, 2170 South Frontage Road, right near the Tamale Place. A lot of people know where the Tamale Place That's is. That's right. Um, and yes, I do refinancing and purchases. Um, we do all loans, conventional government loans, uh, which is VA, Rural Development, FHA. Mm -hmm. um, so we have all that available. We also do construction permanent loans. So. Mm -hmm. A lot of great things to offer. A lot offer. of different things. Yes. And, and I do know this. It's a streamlined process with you. Yes. Um, you take great care of your customers. You don't beat around the bush. You make right. them go chasing stuff down that they don't need or might exactly. not need. Um, it's pretty painless yes. and pretty easy. Yeah. NOLA Lending, that is all we do is mortgages. And so it's kind of, we specialize in one thing and we try to do it at the best of our ability mm -hmm. um, and um, try to get customers in and out of there. Um, our average close time is 18 business days. Mm -hmm. So you're looking at from start to finish process less than a month to right. buy your dream home. So less than three weeks. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Thank so. you so much for coming down here today and for having coffee with me. And um, I look forward to well not yeah. seeing you tomorrow, yeah. but I'll be there. Have to see you soon. Okay. Thank you. Thanks, Thank you for having me.